Yeah, it's great to have this new LTE network actually in use now. So we're very pleased about that and continue to see really good results and experiences from customers. But you're right, what are they going to use it for? And there are many new applications and we're demonstrating some of them to today. Um, we've got an application that really improves um, your communication with all your friends and family. Um, it's called E+, and what it is is a kind of what we call a rich communication suite. And it sits on your phone, an Android phone, an iPhone, or a BlackBerry, and enables you to kind of keep in contact with everyone, not just with uh, normal voice calls, but through voice over IP and through any sort of messaging uh, uh, that you would want to do as well. So that's one example. And then in the, the corporate area, we're starting to do uh, other, other, offer other applications, such as uh, health applications like mBaby where we're offering people the opportunity to see the ultrasound scans remotely um, during the, the pregnancy, which is obviously important from a health point of view. And, and that's an application that uses a lot of bandwidth and can work on a, a high bandwidth network like LTE. So the fiber optic network um, is, as you know, well rolled out. There's a little bit more to do and we're starting to see more and more people and businesses take up the opportunity of using the higher speeds uh, available. And um, th these are enabling businesses to use many more of the cloud services. So some of the security applications that we've already launched on the cloud are uh, available and, and obviously much better over a fiber network. And then all the other normal business applications that companies run on uh, are much better experience and enable a company to be much more efficient, much more productive using our, our fiber, fiber networks.